so i think yeah it is it is different in different regions and then you know across regions we look at different behaviors uh you know the the way restaurants are adapting to this new trend of you know somewhere it's called cloud kitchen or dark kitchens but but largely it caters to the the urban centers where it is very different for brands to acquire real estate and of course real estate is a, is one of the biggest cost heads for for any uh, restaurants and and usually you know historically it has been uh, a very difficult uh, decision for a brand to establish or or to acquire an address uh, what dark kitchen uh, provides as an advantage is the ease of establishment and ease of wrapping up the business right so by by nature it uh, you know the feature of the dark kitchen or the cloud kitchen is it's a it's an establishment that can be uh, not not really makeshift like a pop up but it can be no frills establishment which the brands can use really to provide a delivery only service uh, you know it really helps the brand to uh, to to establish themselves as close as possible to the urban consumers uh, and not just like you know outside the urban areas or, or you know wherever the large or or just limiting to to the high street address right uh, you know it is of course challenging uh, in terms of you know uh, continuously adapting but but there are various ways the brands are you know adopting to this trend for example you know one of the key trend that we see um, in our markets uh, right now is a sort of multi brand dark kitchen or multi brand uh, delivery only restaurants so you, so you don't have only one brand going out of that you know the dark kitchen so based on the ingredients available you repurpose uh, you know the area available to to churn out multiple brands right so nobody is able to you know the consumers are not able to really differentiate whether uh, the two brands are coming from different established places or different yeah. real estates uh, or is it is it coming from a simple uh, a small uh, kitchen that is established in the urban center so it 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 poses a lot of opportunity to the brands to repurpose and of course it provides increased value to the consumer because of course you are able to you know pr uh, price it lower than probably a dine in dish uh, but it is i i don't believe that it destroys any value even for the brands but but it provides the opportunity to create value you know to have the optimized choice in terms of you know what the consumers really want and providing that in the in the in the in terms of you know uh, the real time demand wherever they need it you know providing as much as closer to possible